implementation of the Food and Drink in Schools Scotland 2020 regulations. Changes to secondary school food and drinks. The new regulations are part of the Scottish Government's plans to halve childhood obesity by 2030 and are aligned closely with the Scottish dietary goals that centre around four key themes to make school meals even healthier. This video is to provide you with all the essential information on changes that will affect you and the school meal service you provide. New food standards have been introduced to cover secondary school food. Here is a brief overview of the standards. Decrease in red meat and red processed meat products. This includes pork, sausages, beef burgers. A decrease in the amount of sugar, fat and saturated fat allowed in sweetened and baked goods. A decrease in the use of pastry and pastry products. Bread must now be high in fibre. Only sugar-free drinks are permitted. An 80 gram portion of salad or vegetables must be produced with any lunch item. In other words, all hot snacks and deli items, any vending machines with sandwiches. Red and red processed meat is limited to 230 grams over the school week, of which 130 gram may be red processed meat. This covers breakfast, morning break and lunch. To put this in perspective, a slice of ham weighs 36 grams. If it was on daily morning break and lunch, it would total 180 grams of red processed meat. Red processed includes ham, pork and beef sausages, bacon, hot dogs, chorizo and beef burgers. The reduction of red meat in schools has occurred due to the links to increased risk factors associated with colorectal cancer. It has also been linked to heart disease. We appreciate that ham is a popular item within the schools, so to ensure its availability, the following will be in place. The whole red meat allowance will be used at lunch times, so no red meat or red processed meat will be served at morning break. Ham will be available every day at lunchtime. There will be no change to the frequency of red meat on the main meal menu. At morning break, a whole new range of items will be available in place of ham, burgers, sausages, etc. These should be actively promoted and samples offered where possible to encourage uptake. All sweetened and baked products now have to be lower in sugar and fat. The aim of this is to try and reduce the amount of sugar and fat consumed by school pupils. A number of things will no longer be available, including the Craig Miller cake and muffin mixes, waffles and decorative icing, in other words, buttercream and water icing. Extensive recipe testing has been completed to ensure a wide range of home baking. The current range includes donuts, custard cream, oaty biscuit, jammy dodger, tiffin, gypsy cream, golden crunchy, ice cream, cookies, muffins and a gluten-free Madeira slice. Pastry products such as pies and croissants can only be served twice a week. The allocation of this allowance will be used at lunch times on days when pastry is on the main menu. For further information on when pastry can be used, consult your pastry information for the 2021-22 menu. All breads must now contain a minimum of 3 grams of fibre per 100 grams. A wide range of current rolls, paninis and baguettes still comply with the new regulations and new breads and wraps have been sourced to add to your range. All drinks will now be sugar free. A range of flavoured waters will now be on offer including Radnor Splash, Calypso, Macbees and Viva. We are currently trying to source a sugar-free hot chocolate. 80 gram portions of fruit and or vegetables must be available at all points of service at breakfast and morning break. At lunchtime, an 80 gram portion of mixed salad or vegetable sticks must be offered with all hot snack and deli or salad bar items and will be included in the price. Salad or vegetables, for example veggie sticks, 
must be provided free of charge with all lunchtime items. Two portions of salad or vegetables and one portion of fruit must be available and included in the price of a meal deal. For pre-ordered meals, salad and vegetables must be available at collection point for pupils to choose. 80 gram portions of salad and vegetable six and fruit portions should be at service points so they can be offered to pupils who have purchased items that constitute a meal deal. For further information, follow the fruit and vegetable guidance.